How's it going, everybody? Everybody doing good? All right. Well, we're out here in the old time cave and burning kerosene. Yeah, good old kerosene. So, and we started the video off with a recent um, update to the garage. The old cast iron pot bellied stove that I have is now in the garage. Uh, earlier this week, I um, managed to uh, relieve my collection of a antique radio. A friend of mine, good friend of mine, saw one in my garage uh, not too long ago, and he decided to have it. He wanted it, so he made me an offer, and I uh, I accepted. So. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good. And uh, I've had it for a very long time. And it was kind of hard to let it go. But since he's a good friend and he lives here in town, it's kind of like going to stay in the family. And it's going to be enjoyed. It wasn't being enjoyed out here. It was just being stored. And uh, so he was totally stoked. So I'm like, okay, it's time to pass it on. I've had my time with it. And uh, I won't not see it again. So why not? So that gave me more room in the garage to play with, which I needed. And uh, the back porch was kind of getting crowded with stuff, and uh, so I moved the cast iron stove out here. And I have it near the bench so I can put a little kerosene uh, lamp burner in it and uh, make it, give it the uh, aesthetic of uh, burning, you know, a nice cozy fire in there. But since it's not hooked up to any stove pipe, that would be not advisable, so <laughs> I wouldn't light it. I wouldn't burn a fire in it. Um, not yet, anyways. Uh, anyhow, I did have to light a fire in it um, on Monday uh, to vacate any unwanted uh, tenants in it because it did attract a lot of spiders uh, when it was out on the back porch, and so I had to clean it up and do some, uh, you know, prep work to bring it out here so it wasn't going to be you know, bringing unwanted guests to my time cave. <laughs> so I did that outside in the uh, the alleyway, so it was safe. Tons of concrete around, nothing dangerous about it. Anyway, so now it sits out here, and I can sit and enjoy watching the flame flicker inside of the, uh, the stove and, you know, pretend. So this is a pretend space, time cave. That's where time stands still, and you can do things in here that most people wouldn't understand. So it's all good. Burning the old Paul's number zero, and uh, just uh, you know, it's late. Uh, it's very late. It's actually 1:20. I'm not tired or sleepy at all, and I'm kind of upset because I would like to be sleeping right now. But I thought, well, I might as well make a little video for everyone out there while I'm wide awake. So yeah. Anyhow, hope everything's going good for everyone out there. Uh, things are good over on our side. Uh, my wife and I are, are very fortunate to be working and uh, taking care of business. And, well, hope everybody's taking care of themselves and keeping their family safe and taken care of. And hopefully, fingers crossed, we will be going back to normal or what will be normal uh, in the near future. Um, we are you know, concerned about a lot of things, of course. Uh, people getting sick and spreading the sickness and or not having anything to return to after recovering from this lockdown and these uh, quarantines uh, because the economy is going to be, it's going to be interesting to watch it uh, try and come back. And I, I fear that history is going to repeat itself in a masterful way because we we just had we we're experiencing a, an epidemic and as we recall before the 1920s there was a pretty bad epidemic into the 1920s and then what followed was a great depression so let's let's hope this this isn't uh gonna repeat itself i don't care for that but anyhow we're doing okay and we're keeping things real we're keeping it together and uh, trying to focus on the things that we have and not the things that we don't. So, with that, I leave you and wish everyone a good night, or good morning actually, and from the Time Cave. So please, uh, if you like these videos, I see some good comments, but 
please thumbs up and ring that subscription bell or notification bell and become a subscriber if you like my content because eh, you know more the merrier it doesn't hurt so all right everybody have a great night and we will see you again very soon bye bye